has there been any type of um, lyrical, uh, either inspiration or connection to uh, either one of those people the Mason Jennings? Or? Specifically Mason Jennings, uh, just because I mean, I think he's, uh, he's, he's strictly instrumental. Okay. Uh, Mason Jennings, uh, Bob Dylan, his, his lyrics are always amazing. Uh, so it's like just makes you a story to play it out. Um, I mean, sorry, um, so I, I would say two Mason Jennings and Bob Dylan lyrically, uh, those, those are those are good inspirations. Um. Okay. So, is there any type of formula that you have where you use? sort of set out how you're going to write a song, like say, you know, I'm going to lay down this guitar track and then put lyrics on top of it, or do you go more of a uh, lyrical type of focus? How do you go about approaching that way? Yeah, it's funny. I, I've, I've asked uh, other artists, like local artists, uh, that same question um, when I first started writing, because um, I wasn't sure if I was doing it correctly. Right. Um, but apparently there is no correct way to do it. Uh, it's, it's, I found that it's, for me, a lot of times I write the, the melodies and uh, the instrumental parts first, and then I'll flow in with, you know, like, you know, just nonsense lyrics until I start being more comfortable singing with the melodies and stuff. But so you sing scat a little bit then? Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I make a lot of weird sounds. Uh, usually I, I automatically like go into like sappy like songs and mm -hmm. lyrics that make no sense. Okay. A lot of times I'll also be saying gibberish. I'm just trying to match like the melody. Right. Trying to harmonize. But um, I mean, there's other songs that I've come up with lyrics first. Right. And then I uh, um, the you know the instrument uh, parts. But uh, like specifically. <laughs> uh, I'm so sad with this, like there was that religion parody song that I do. Uh, I already had the lyrics. Uh, I just didn't know how I was going to put that to music. Um, I knew I wanted to make a parody. Uh, so I wrote out all these lyrics and uh, sang them to like a simple one, three chord progression tone. And I tried so hard to make it a little bit more complicated with the music. Um, and eventually just wound up going back to the three chord progression that I had in my mind. Um, yeah, that, all that song is, and I think it's like a, a, a G, C, D, oh, okay. throughout yeah. the entire song. So, yeah, it sounds like that kind of progression there. Yeah, it's really simple. Uh, it's really easy. Okay. I was really proud of it when I first played it and uh, first wrote it. I just yeah. remember it like I was just singing the song. I remember hearing that for the first time. That was one of those songs that really cracked me up at that time. But, um, now, do you find it easier to write music one way versus another? Or is no, it no, not really. I mean, uh, I think it's, like I said, I naturally go to writing the, the melodies first. And, right. You know, working on the instrument itself uh, before I approach lyrics. Because um, a lot of times the uh, instrumental parts are really what I'm trying to say. Right. Um, and then me putting the lyrics in, uh, I just kind of like, uh, like, like, I help. 